Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, Justin here, and welcome back to another video. So, uh, to start off, you guys may have noticed that I went ahead and uh, renamed my channel and also got a new uh, profile pic. So, I'm just going to begin this off by talking about that. So, this is a new profile pic. It's still um, a work in progress, I guess. I'm, I'm testing out some other designs. I'm going to see what I ultimately end up liking, but for now, this is it. Uh, the name for the channel is The Crimson Brick. I might take away the and just make it Crimson Brick or uh, The Crimson Bricks. Crimson Bricks? I don't know yet. I'm going to play around with some names, but that's generally what I'm going to go with. Um, <laughs> I thought of the uh, name like Crimson Brick Studios, but it's too similar to another um, YouTuber on here, Solid Brick Studios, so I decided to uh, keep it the way I have it. And yeah, so <laughs> if you guys want some background, uh, here, I'll let you guys know where I came up with the name from. So, uh, some of you guys may have been able to tell uh, from over the years with, I guess, my over excessive liking of a certain color, red, uh, that I, yeah, I like the color red. So, crimson is a, you know, cool shade of red, and it also just sounds cool to say. So, I went ahead and uh, chose that as you know, part of the name. I knew I wanted to work with something that has more meaning than just Jack Production Studios. And yeah, um, along with that, uh, obviously Brick, you know, Lego, but it has some connections to one of my favorite Star Wars characters, Darth Maul. And if you guys haven't seen uh, The Siege of Mandalore, I highly recommend it. Such, such a phenomenal way to end such a beautiful series. I it it's just it's incredible but um yeah anyway so back to the name thing so yeah Darth Maul Crimson Dawn uh so there's that there's it's a um, part of a lyric from one of my favorite songs and then the Crimson Comet's a flash nickname so it just it all works works to make this pretty cool um name and concept for my channel here and going forward um my channel's gonna be more geared towards just general Lego stuff. That's the plan now. Uh, not just general Lego stuff, but like me doing more Lego stuff, I guess. It's kind of stepped away from that recently. And I, yeah, I've done some live streams the last couple weeks, but um, I'm gonna be doing more Lego stuff. I'm still gonna be you know, working on my custom minifigs here. Um, these won't go away. These will still, be, this will be a core of my channel for a little while here while I'm uh, going through getting parts again and just going through what I currently have for Lego. So, yeah. Um, what what else? Uh, live streams. I guess since I mentioned that, I can talk about live streams. So, uh, going forward, every Thursday, um, at least for the past two weeks, there have been live streams on Thursday at 11 p.m. Eastern Time. That'll be the new time that'll stay that way for at least this week's live stream after this week I'm done with school and I can rearrange my work schedule so I might end up doing live streams earlier in the day so that way you guys can um, catch it um, at a better time if you're from the east coast or Europe and whatnot but yeah so it'll be uh, me Chris um, Hector and just some other you know friends I'd give you a list but it changes each week I mean generally the same same people are on but just depends on who's available each week. So yeah, um, I'm still, I'm going through and cleaning my room, so I have like stuff everywhere. Um, that's gonna be a studio area over there, but for now, uh, it's just holding some stuff. Um, all the way over here, this is a mess. I'm going through, I'm starting to sort some parts out. So I'm just grabbing what, you know, is from this giant pile of crap here, and I'm putting that into here. I have a mask from work <laughs> sitting there. Um, but yeah, so. Going through grabbing parts, uh, sort out my dark red. I'm now gonna sort out like my light gray and my dark gray. Um, and yeah, I'm just, I'm going through and seeing what I have in terms of a collection. And then, uh, yeah, what else? Um, customs. So <laughs> I mentioned they're gonna be a crucial part of my channel going forward. Um, like they kind of have been, at least on my Instagram for a while now, but they're going to still be just as important. And if I, uh, open this box that has a name on it, which I can't really show. Um, let's just pull some stuff out here. 
you guys may remember one of my first channel uh, first custom painted figures on this channel was a uh darth maul i believe he was my first it was him or fives but he doesn't this one doesn't have his head on but i made a siege of mandalore darth maul i'm gonna be redoing this figure i have the parts in here uh, to begin to work on him however i don't have the head quite yet so i might i need to figure out what i'm doing for the head i have at least started it but sculpting the horns is gonna be a little bit of a uh difficult thing to do luckily with you know this wallpaper here um i have some reference there but yeah uh, along with him i'm making a an ahsoka tano who whose head pieces are so i'm so working out um this shape for her head piece like i've gone through a few different versions here trying to do some things might revisit this one but yeah so ahsoka darth maul and uh my bo katan um sculpt i made a while ago i'm going to be revisiting this as well those three will be um i'll be making siege of mandalore uh versions of all of them bo katan's outfits basically the same throughout uh the clone wars but i'm going to be going ahead and making those three so i can make a siege of mandalore showcase video um just get some customs out there for you guys to view and uh, I'm going to go back through uh, with some other figures. Like recently I finished up my Ray, which if you guys follow my Instagram, you know, go check that out. I posted her there. She turned out really great. I'm super satisfied with this figure. And uh, thanks to the Wolfpack Customs for the lightsaber. Um, with that Ray, along with uh, some other figures like this Han Solo here, I'm going to go through and begin making showcase videos just for some figures that I've made that don't exactly have um a home i guess they there's not a group of these guys like i don't have other figures i made for tomb raider that I can turn along with this lara here i don't have other figures made for the rise of skywalker show for ray or so far i don't have any of the original trilogy cast to bring along with my han so yeah i'm just gonna begin pumping out showcases uh, other videos um reevaluating what i have cleaning my room getting ready to uh, eventually go into a building series. I'm not sure what I'm building yet. So um, if you guys have anything you'd like to see me build, comment that down below. But as of now, it I want to build Mandalore, but David Hall's already doing that. And um, some other people I know have wanted, have considered the idea. So I'm just not going to touch it right now. For me, I'm satisfied with uh, doing something else, but I'm not sure that is yet. Um, might just do might revisit clone bases you know that'd be pretty cool to go back to but anyway hope you guys enjoyed the video um i'm gonna get back to work on some some stuff clean the room right now um finishing up college won't be done with college but at least for the semester and then i can focus on just working uh lego from here on out and yeah hope you guys are staying safe and see you guys this thursday with the next live stream bye